Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. This is Hendu Jr. and this is a continuation of our Tales of Vesperia Let's Play. If you guys enjoy, please slash that subscribe button and let's go ahead and get on into it. So, we... But yeah, we just got to this area. We just gotta look around, see what we can do. TP recover, mental up. Okay, so I know Rita's is done. Ooh, that's a chest. Open the chest. Par paralysis bottle, okay. Um, yeah, okay, I thought as much. Avengers Scroll 2. Okay. So, Guard Arts and Spirit Absorb. Cool. That should do it. Okay, then. Not how I thought this was going to go, but... That's fine. Straw hat. Yeah, there's not really a whole lot going on. Actually, I think that's the direction I need to go. Let's take a look after I deal with these bastards. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? Not a- Oh, I feel so pa- Yay. Uh... Yay. It looks like a dead end. Should we head back, or- Hold on. I'm gonna have a look around. Weird. There's not a keyhole or anything. Really? Yuri, an amateur like you would never be able to open a door like... Pink! What the? I wouldn't want Captain Carol to dirty his hands on such a filthy door. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> right. <laughs> uh, well, shall we? Wouldn't it be crazy if a monster just gobbled up your foot right now? Just a giant munch and oops, no more foot. <laughs> what? What? Eh, looks fine to me. Let's go inside. <laughs> what am I? Your chest dummy? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Yuri, you're a bastard. <laughs> your dick is what you are. Mitts off it. I don't want to have to tell you again. It seems like it might be an activation switch for the warp blastia upstairs. Nothing's happening. It doesn't have enough air. Not enough air. I wonder if that ring I got in the Shikos ruins might be able to do anything. Ah, the sorcerer's ring. I'm not sure, but you might as well give it a try. It worked. Maybe that means we'll be able to use the warp blasty upstairs. Let's go. Yay. Alright, 
can we yep all right there's a few items scattered about in here Ooh, well Matt nice I don't think there's a whole lot more. There's a lot of items scattered out throughout the entire map, so just gotta look around and be cautious of what you're looking over. Let's get this over with. I wanna see if that doorway over there is unlocked. Oh jeez. Okay. Hey, cool. Sukiyaki. I'll take that. Yep. Awesome. It did do exactly what I was hoping it would. Passcode. So that passcode. Light. Okay. I already know the answer, but. It is what it is. All right. Making me fight that thing again. Let's get It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because you've lived a lot long. No. Hey, one star. That didn't take long. Move forward. Because the other two don't go anywhere. Yeah, there's a few monsters around here. Let's get this over with. Aha. I feel power run. Yay. Yeah, get out of my way. Let's get this over with. Yours. It's pretty, huh? That's not what I was gonna say. These are the threads that we were HP condition three. Nice. Downstairs. Oh, all right, that works. Could save spot. Cool, cool. At least I know where to backtrack to. Apple shell. Tail dress, king sized belt, the 
and then this is the only way forward otherwise. So, to the left or to the right? I want to go left. Yep, perfect. Come on, thank you. All right. So, yeah, there's something over here that I can grab real quick. Really? That's just annoying. Put out your hand. Like this? Yay! What was that? Hey, I learned something. Magic three. Resist three. Yay. Where is Yuri currently? Still one star cool. Shadow Fang. Okay. I'm pretty sure I have another. Yes. So. Real Knight Sword. Combo Force and Evade 3. Yeah, why not? And then. Ooh. Repeat's just about done with his. Cool. Apple gel. Yay. Ooh, One thousand gold. Cool. Nothing, really. Jeez. Should be another clue down here though, if I can get around. Oh. Passcode 2, sky. Light and sky. I mean, if that's not enough of a giveaway, I, I don't know what is. If I remember correctly, I think the third clue was sphere. So... To be fair, I suppose I could see. Oh, okay. So it looks like the Blood Alliance isn't here after all. Those guys are the Hunting Blades. But that man, we saw him in Dadon Hold. Ah, now that you mention it, we did see him. So he's the leader of your guild then. He's gonna fight that monster all by himself? What? No way, man! He took it out in one hit? That was a fatal strike! A fatal strike? It's a crazy powerful technique that extremely skilled swordsmen can use. Huh. So how do you do it? How do you do it? How should I know? Mm hmm? Fatal Strike, a strong attack which throws your opponent off balance, followed by a single well-timed strike to finish the enemy. Is that something else you read in a book? Y yes, it is. I see. It sounds like it's easier said than done. You really want to get back into your guild, don't you? W what makes you say that? Oh, Carol, are you going to go back to that guild? I won't go back. I'm sick and tired of monster hunting. Mm -hmm. Won't go back or can't go back. It sounded like you were fired. No way. I'd been planning on leaving for a while. Mm -hmm. Is that so? Well, no matter then. So, uh, let's get going. Well, I'm glad you're staying with us, Carol. Anyway, what do you think they're doing with such a large contingent? Yeah, they wanted to take out that monster we saw. One person would have been enough. 
This is actually the first time I've ever seen this many guild members gathered in one place. Really? Yeah. A lot of the members are loners. They tend not to travel in groups. And the chief being here is out of the ordinary, too. Curiouser and curiouser. You want to follow them and see what they're up to? Nah, that sounds interesting, but I'm going to keep going. He is looking for members of the Blood Alliance after all. Right, Yuri? Yeah, I don't want to worry about two guilds. One is more than enough. <laughs> all right, so... There we go. Oh. oh, nope. I thought maybe the last passcode would be here, but doesn't look like it. Okay. Oh, a mimic. How about that? That don't happen often. Oh, okay. Really? F off, dude. Yep, that's all for the gold. Four grand in gold. Uh, three grand in ex experience, so I guess that's something pretty big, too. Try and see if I can get into that building in the back. Let's get this over with. Were you fighting? Cause I felt nothing. <laughs> Damn. That's a little uh, ruthless. Oh, hellfire! There we go. All right. So go ahead and. Get his next weapon. Crimson Phoenix 1. It should be Crimson Phoenix 2B and 2A. Ah, they both give FS bonus. Okay. So this gives Chain and HP recover. So we'll go ahead and equip that. And yep, everyone else is still working on it. Pull. Can I? No. Pointless. All right. So. Oh. Okay. Tutorial fight. Yay. I think I'll try to do that thing. Uh. What was that just now? That fatal strike thing. Is it something that can be done so easily? Hey, I won't know if I can until I try. How did it go again? Um, first you attack the enemy to throw it off balance. Alrighty. Um, uh, Yuri. Add an attack and prepare for the fatal strike. My opening to attack, and then ah, uh, it's R two. <laughs> well, you need a little skill, but it's not really that hard. You think you could do it while watching me? All right, let's go. Amount of XP, LP, as well as item drop rates increase when you defeat an enemy with Fatal Strike. That was fun. Amazing. 
Yeah, no, no grade, so it was obviously a tutorial fight. Yay. Okay. Yeah, so you can see the bars up there. The the three bars at the bottom of the uh, inv information page is the forms of off balance. So sending them up, sending them down, or sending them uh, backwards. And as you use moves that do those individual things, those bars will drop until they're down completely. And that's when you strike with your uh, yeah. fatal strike. Next week? Next week? Really? No. All right. Crucible Othenor. Hey. All right. There we go. Deadly Horn, Defense 2, Magic Guard plus, High Fatal Tension. Go ahead and equip that. Cool. Alright, so. I can't go in there. I can, however, go in here. I've been holding off on that. Holy Raven, Gel, go up, fire. All right, forward or to the right? Let's go to the right. There should be... Yep, there's at least a treasure there. Surugi. Nice. Yeah, hi, you big turtle. Guess we can do this. Okay. Yep, so the whole point of that is the Sorugi. That's pretty much it. <clears throat> now we go back in to go forward to continue with the story. Yay. I know where there's a save point. I'm kind of hoping there's one nearby here as well. Nope. Don't need it. Alright, this should be where the last note is. Maybe. I know there's three. Hmm. Interesting. Passcode three. Yep. Sphere. Thought so. Open the damn chest. Holy crap. Okay, so with all of that, we can now go to the area that I was just in. I gotta figure out how I'm gonna get there. Pretty sure I need to drop down one more. And I'm pretty sure it's right here. Oh. I didn't have a chance to ask you this, but You mean me? Why didn't you return to the capital when we were in Torum Harbor? Why? Oh yeah. Stone wanted to tell Flynn that he's being hunted, right? Yeah, at that point your journey should have ended. 
Well, uh, you see. Hey, by the way, who was hunting Flynn down anyway? Uh, I'm not quite sure. Mm. Wasn't it Rego? Huh? That villain? Yoder was on Rago's ship, and Yoder's the Imperial Prince. Yeah, so... I'm saying that I think Flynn's true mission was to find Yoder. Though I don't know why things would end up that way between big shots from the same Empire. I'm sorry. I don't know either. Well, that's okay. But what about you? Are you sure you don't want to go back? Well, I kind of just went with the flow and came along from Torm Harbor. I think maybe I wanted to keep traveling with everyone a bit longer, so, uh... Besides, we still haven't gotten the Blastia Core back yet. That's true, but isn't that my business? Can't I help out? <laughs> mm, yeah, sure. Feel free to come along. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Ah, uh, adorable. All right, I'm pretty sure this is the area that I'm wanting. Yep, awesome. All right, it might be a little early, but let's see where we get. Because I think there's a save point down at the bottom as well, a healing save point at that. Ah, <sighs> yay, going down in a circle. This is so much fun. We Yay. It's not exactly a long one, but it's definitely annoying. There we go. Oh no, there's no save point down here. Oh shit. What's up? I feel kinda sick all of a sudden. Even someone as dense as you can feel it. Who are you calling? Wait, does that mean you can feel it too? Oh, what a feeling. I love how everyone is suffering, and yet Rapid and Yuri look like they're just fine. <laughs> everyone else is hunched over trying to keep themselves up, and Yuri is just standing, no problem. Like, ah, oh, that's, that's a little uncomfortable. Exert yourself. We can rest here and have a look around. Seriously, what's going on? Ever since we got here, if a monster attacked us right now, I don't think I'd be up to it. Saying stuff like that is the best way to attract monsters, you know. Mm -hmm. If you're gonna keel over, couldn't you do it in the middle of a crowded city street? <laughs> Can't be expected to be there to catch you every time. Yes, thank you. I'm still doing okay. This is air. What? I thought air couldn't be seen with the naked eye. If it's dense enough, it can be. Estelle, weren't you saying something about that earlier? That dense air is bad for the body. Yes. High-density air can occasionally have very negative effects on the human body. It made you pass out in the Koi woods, too. Really? Wow. Maybe we should get out of here. But we still haven't made sure if the mercenaries are here or not. I guess that's true, but... Let's keep moving. It looks like this Blastia is linked to the door. How do we open it? It seems that we have to carefully put together the symbols to form the right phrase. Wouldn't it be faster to break in? That's not a good idea. What if it makes the door stop working? Hey, something's coming out of it. So, should we just put some letters in here? Hey, didn't we pick up some odd pieces of paper? Actually, come to think of it, could this be a clue to the passcode? Seems we need to use our mind to get an answer. Let's look at the paper again. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and call it good there. 
Thank you all so much for joining me on this Let's Play of Tales of Vesperia. I'm having a blast playing this, and there's a lot of story left to work on, but you know what? I'm okay with that. As long as you guys are willing to deal with my rambling and failing in fights, then I'm willing to keep progressing through and dealing with this game. I say that, but it's one of my favorite games that I've ever played. So, but thank you all for joining me on this, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye.